There's a nice rock garden here on the east side of the temple. I walked over to the east gate, uh, which I had walked by a few days ago. And I'm going to go back down to Tiananmen Square to exit. A little rose garden. Hmm. Take a little walk through here and see what's in the garden. This is probably the most pleasant part of the temple. A lot of wedding photos are going on inside the temple, which is kind of neat. To the last chaders waltz. Got that song in my head again now. I was saying in my last uh, video how it was an earworm because they were playing it every morning at breakfast at the hostel. And I finally got rid of it and then I mentioned it again and now it's in my head again. I didn't have enough time go by before I got rid of it. Rid of it. The neural pathway has to degenerate significantly. Or become associated with something else. Now we're back the way I came in, amongst the cypresses once again. And the chatter of birds. If you come here early enough, supposedly you'll see people with their bird cages out. They take their birds out early in the morning for exercise and to meet other birds. An old tradition. Crown Prince Wood. Ancient cypresses. They didn't. The princes were young and naughty, and they didn't arrange them in an orderly fashion, which I think is better. There's a section over at Tiantan, in the uh, eastern section of Tiantan Temple, down in the south of Beijing. And they're all ordered. The trees are like completely ordered in rows and it looks really weird. You feel like you're in an orchard, not a garden. So you want some symmetry. You don't want it to be like crazy, but you don't want it to be an orchard. <laughs> Those naughty princes. The crown prince would. And we're back at the entrance gate just up here to the uh, main hall. <laughs> to the Lash Cheaters Waltz. <laughs> God. All the songs you could have in your head, head when you're in the Orient. Oh no, little baby. So that's the main entrance to the, uh, the temple complex.